How you guys doing today? Good, 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 good. good. Didn't rain too much. No, it was sweet. Yeah, we're supposed to have lightning at one point this week, so <laughs> that's awesome. <laughs> Jeff assess today and maybe the whole month. How it's been? What, what the culmination was today? What, what, do you, what do you expect? Um, you know, I think today we. Uh, we did some things well, but then again, we also did some things not so well. Um, I think this has been a good month for us in terms of just developing and growing as a new unit. Um, you know, a lot of pieces to replace from last fall, and you know, I think so far these four weeks, 15 practices, we've done a good job of that, but we still worked today. Coach said uh, maybe you guys made it too easy on the defense. Did you, did you, I don't really know what he was referring to, but they were ball hawking today. What, what did you think of that? Um, well, usually you don't want to throw it to them, so that's a start. <laughs> um, but, you know, I, honestly, I don't know exactly what he meant by that, but I know the quarterbacks in the offense could be a little bit sharper today. Um, so, again, we'll watch the film and try and uh, get better. Describe your personal progress uh, in spring ball versus, say, a year ago. Yeah, um, a big piece for me was just accuracy. I think I've done a lot better this spring. Um, obviously, there's, there's still, you know, room to do. There's throws that day that I could throw a little bit better. But um, that was kind of my big point. If this is something that come a long way there. And then in terms of just understanding the offense, is, you know, that's part of just kind of growing as a quarterback. I think that's, that piece has been a lot, better, a lot better for me this spring. Is there anything that has contributed to your accuracy? It seems like it's picked up a lot. Yeah, um, just honestly throwing with the guys and getting more comfortable with the guys you're throwing to is a big piece of it. So you can kind of you know, predict where they're going to be when they run their routes and stuff. And that, uh, that, uh, that plays a big piece in it. Jeff, this quarterback as a group over the spring. What do you think of the progress? Saw. Yeah, I thought it was great progress. Um, obviously, I'm kind of the old guy of the group, but the two young guys I thought actually had a really good spring. You know, Jake, um, Mr. Protege out of high school, and he had a really, really good spring. He uh, picked up in the offense really well, and I, I was really impressed by that. And then, you know, KJ had a great fall run in the scout team, and he was he, he was very sharp this spring also. So I think going into the summer, you know, the three of us are in pretty good shape moving forward. What do you think the, the summer looks like for you, like workout-wise? And Throwing the ball um, well, I'm sure the coaches know better than I do, but you know we'll be out here running, working out with the guys, and we'll probably be throwing a couple times a week, and just trying to get sharper as a unit. How about the guys you're throwing to, Jay Don, and all those guys, the receivers? How do you think they did? Yeah, they, they've done a great job. Again, when it came to kind of replacing some senior pieces, obviously we lost Case and then DeAndre. So I think Jay Don and kind of the guys, um, everyone's done a good job stepping up and filling in for those two guys. Um, uh, I think they've done a great job this spring, and you know I'm excited to throw to those guys later in the summer and into the fall. You described that Jadon touchdown pass. But, uh, yeah, that was one heck of a catch, to be honest. I kind of, you know, was rolling out a little bit and saw, saw that. 50 50 ball that you threw, you think? Uh, well, I like to think it's a little bit better than that. But, you know, I just threw it to Jadon. He made a great catch and brought it down for me. So, props to that guy. That was impressive. No doubt. So, Jeff, were you, were you surprised that Jeff from Mercer Island won the long toss? Um, you know, I, I had confidence in myself, but you know, I just had to go out and do my best, and I think I did all right. So. It was also a little surprising to see you throw a pick. It, it's kind of one of the things you haven't really been doing this spring. Yeah, I mean, it happens, obviously. I could have thrown a better ball on that, but I give some credit to our defense, and they tricked me a little bit. Um, but it's not something you ever want to do, but again, you can learn from it, and I know how to fix that next time. And Coach Pete actually singled out a guy like Sean Constantine as, as a guy who's really stepped up. What, what have you seen from him? Uh, going up against him this spring. Yeah, well, Sean physically has developed really well. Um, you know, being out there just kind of hitting guys and um, knowing his assignments, he's done a great job. But then even off the field, Sean's a really great leader for us. He's really positive and, you know, brings guys along with him. So in terms of just how he is as a football player, he's been doing well, but even even more so as a leader on this team. Hey, Jeff, confidence-wise, it seems like you've really grown over the spring. I mean, you're probably really confident last year as well, but it helps to have some success in, in, the, in the spring, right? Uh, I mean, definitely. Obviously, when you play well, you kind of you know, put that under your belt and keep moving forward. And, you know, I've had some good practices, but I've also had some not very good practices. So, again, the spring is mainly for all of us. It's just learning and getting better because we're not playing any games yet. So, as we move forward into the summer and fall, again, that's what kind of tightened it up. But, you know, where I'm right now, I'm pretty happy. That's to play in front of people for, for a change? Yeah, that's always fun. You know, it's fun being out there with the guys, but it's also fun playing in front of you know, Husky fans. It's always a good time. And what, what was the sensation of that going up for the first kind of scrimmaging that everyone got a chance to scream? I mean, I know you guys have probably been able to make a lot of those doors, but taking guys down, things like that, how much does that add a little different element to the mix in spring? Yeah, you know, it, I mean, obviously it's tough to replicate, replicate games, but that's kind of as close as we can get is going live. So I think for a lot of guys, it's just kind of good experience with, uh, you know, going as close to full speed as we can. Um, just think for a team, obviously you can't get, do it too much in the spring because you want guys to stay healthy, but... Um, just doing that, I think, is really good for us to kind of learn and get better. Well, once that first guy goes down, Jeff, do you feel like there's a little bit of an intensity thing that ratchets up, or guys all of a sudden kind of real? Okay, this is for real. We we get to actually play a little bit now. Um, you know, I think guys definitely like it. Obviously, you guys are out here because they enjoy the elements of football that involves hitting. So when they get to do that, people are always excited to play. And um, you know, I think ideally we're always focused on every set, no matter how what tempo we're going. But 
Obviously, playing live, guys kind of crank it up a little bit. Jeff, you feel like just because of the experience that you have that the other two guys don't have, that this is in some ways kind of your job to win going into fall camp. You feel like that? Uh, I mean, maybe. Obviously, it's a uh, it's kind of you know the big hype, the quarterback competition, all that. But again, I think the spring is more focused on all of us just getting better, and then in the, in the fall is maybe when the competition will ramp ramp up because again, we're not playing games right now, but. Yeah. Um, you know, obviously, I, I want to win the job, but again, ultimately, the goal is for us to win, is to win Rose Bowls, and whoever's the best guy leading the show, then that's the way it should be. What do you think the next couple of months, just from a study perspective, dedication perspective? I mean, here you are, you're a local guy, and you're months away from maybe being the starting quarterback in Washington. Mm -hmm. what, what's the next three, four months going to be like for you? Um, again, I think it's just kind of getting out, getting out around the guys, throwing with them. Um, I don't think you can throw enough with throwing receivers. You know, it's kind of that level of comfort's huge. So I think that's going to be a big piece for all the quarterbacks moving forward, and then again, just kind of be around the guys and. Yeah. Kind of working on that, that unity of the team and pushing us together as one unit. And then how's your how's your chemistry with the receivers, you think, it just kind of compared to where it was a year ago? Um, again, just being around those guys more often makes it a lot better to throw them. And, you know, they're good guys. We always have fun when we go out and play together. And, uh, you know, I'm excited to move forward with those guys out there. Your responsibility to kind of get the guys together then this summer? Uh, we'll see. I mean, I'm going to do what I can, obviously, but I'm not going to force myself in a leadership role. If guys don't need me to do it, obviously I'm happy to do it. So, again, as we move forward, that'll kind of be a piece that will just fall into place. Has Jake impressed you with like his maturity for for a guy who's you know, no doubt? I mean, yeah. I, I was really impressed when Jake came in, and you know, I kind of took the Papa Bear role a little bit with him because I'm the old guy in the group and <laughs> expected to kind of have to tutor him on every little you know detail. But he's he's really sharp, so I've been very impressed with how well Jake has transitioned to college and gotten used to our new playbook. And being at you know this speed of the game is a lot different than than high school, and he's mm -hmm. done a really really good job with that. How old are you?